brought to you by Sprint. Welcome, everyone. Let's see if we can spice up your Tuesday night with a little halftime report. New York leading against the Rockets in Houston. They're looking to solidify their postseason position right now. They're sitting in sixth place in the conference standings. And if you like scoring, you love their first half of basketball. They're putting up points, doing it rapidly in a variety of ways. It's hard to slow them down. There's been some great work by Alec Burks in this one. He's been making it look easy filling up the point column. For the Rockets, they haven't had the same luck. Too many turnovers. Tough to win when you're giving the ball away as easily as they have. They need to start playing smarter basketball in the second half. DJ Augustine making the most of his minutes. Had to break 11 points and some nice plays offensively, getting the assists going. And now, let's check out the other game still going on. A tight game for the Nuggets, squaring off against the Sacramento Kings. They're behind by four points in the third quarter. Now let's check out what's going to be coming up later on. Over at Quicken Loans Arena, the Cavaliers will face off against the Raptors. 8 p.m. Eastern, that one gets started. And that does it for us here in the studio. Thanks so much for joining me. And now, back out to Kevin and the gang. The Sprint Halftime Report, presented by Sprint. Welcome back, everybody. Third quarter just about to get going here in what has been so far a runaway game. Rockets trail by 15. We've got Olenek. DJ Augustine out there with Porter. Then there's Gordon, and it's Wilson in at the four spot. That's the five for Houston right now. Here's Frank. Wilson with the block. And here's the fast break. Porter leading the way. So the whistle blows on the shot and two free throws for the contact right there. Easy call there. No question about that. You can hear the impact from where I am. This is his first trip to the line tonight. The Knicks making a switch here. He doesn't get the second one. To the middle. And Noel throws it down off. Putting on a show for these people. I cannot believe he pulled that one out <laughs> in the course of an actual game. Are you kidding me? Oh, man. Might as well flaunt it if you've got it, Clark. Porter gets a screen from Wilson. Get there, get there. Now, here's Porter, defended by Barrett. Porter, no luck. The Knicks leading by 17. Oh, and there's the out. Oh! 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 How's that for a one-man show? Put this fellow on Broadway. Self-service. The most magnificent alley-oop he could have chosen. <laughs> and he pulled it off, too. Remarkable. Augustine with the steal. He kicks to Porter. And here they go. Here's Olenek. Foul call that time on the way up. That'll give him two chances at the free throw line here. And this is his second trip to the line tonight. Well, he's right there at about 71% from the line this season. Probably somewhere below where he'd like to be. And the Knicks making a change here. Payton's checked in. For New York, they've gone two of three from the field to start the second half. To the inside, tries to keep it alive. He dishes it to Noel. That one goes. Curry. Noel. Noel's got eight points. Well, it's been a poor defensive effort. When that ball has gone inside into the post, they've been in trouble. Yep, points in the paint clearly going against them now. It has not been an ideal start to the second half. They've missed three of their first four. Passes it to Randall. He's against Wilson. Just five on the clock. Cans it from downtown. 21 points in the game. Coming out strong here in the third quarter. That's four for five shooting for this team. Now a timeout called by Houston. He can't be pleased with all these easy looks they continue to give up in the game. They're just way too porous as a defense right now. A lot of holes in that defense. It's a good time to use a timeout here. Augustine dishes to Porter. Augustine passes to Wilson. Nick Stahl. Randall. That's his second personal foul. Gordon for three. 
They're struggling here. They're just one of five to start this third quarter. They've got to loosen up here. You know, they're not totally dominating the glass, but they're definitely doing enough to keep this lead right where it is. Well, if you're doing enough good things and you're maintaining a, at least a, a slight edge on the boards, you're usually going to be in pretty good shape. From 10 feet out, they retain possession. Here's Knox, and the Knicks hit again from deep. The defenders need to talk to each other. The communication lacking there on that three-pointer. And Augustine kicks to Gordon. Gordon with another miss. Been a real difficult game for him offensively, and it's costly. Peyton passes to Randall. New York moving it around. Back to Peyton. Tries a three. The Rockets pull it in. Olenek's got his fifth rebound right now in the game. Here's Gordon on the money from 12 feet away. Gordon's got eight points. New York calls timeout. He saw some things out there that needed adjusting. He wants to talk it over a little bit with his club. I don't think you can ever go wrong burning the timeout if you see something you don't like and you need to talk about. And stolen by Gordon. Puts the lead pass in front of him. And finished off by the corner. Boy, I love it. Active hands on the steal, active feet on the fast break. And hard power on the dunk. And guys, this is just too close of a game to be giving the ball up like that and then failing to get back in transition. We've gone about three and a half minutes into the third now. Peyton drives in. Pass to Knox. Fires for three. It's rebounded by Wilson. They've been able to get out to this lead without really getting a very reliable performance out of him from the field. Gordon. He feeds it to Augustine. Blanketed by the Deans. Fights to the rim for the layup. Augustine's got 13. The Knicks leading by 17. Peyton passes to Knox. It's going to be two free throws through contact on the shot. And a moment here to take a look at the scoring breakdown for the Knicks. Guys, their play close to the hoop has been great all game. And their passing also continues to be outstanding, Clark. In the second half, we're really seeing a good, efficient offense as a result of that ball move. Statistically speaking, let's see where the Rockets sit right now. Ninth in blocks, 13th in free throw percentage. And as far as fewest turnovers per game, not a strong suit. They've struggled here top 20 in the league those numbers can get you beat now this is a team that really relies on those blocks that you talked about Clark, because uh, when they're at their best they're really challenging every shot they cover up they close out on jump shooters and if you penetrate and get to the rim they've got a host of shot blockers there waiting for you uh clark i'm guessing that wasn't the plan for the d on that trip <laughs> and i'm agreeing with you there once they open the lane up for him that was a little emphasis on that finish. Take what the defense gives you and then just power it home, right? Why not? There's Porter with the three. The Knicks pull it in. And that'll increase their rebound advantage. They've definitely been winning that battle on the board. Well, the main thing is they haven't allowed many second chance opportunities. And that is always going to allow you to maintain your lead. Gordon dishes to Augustine. And he drops in the way up off the glass. Augustine's got four points now in the quarter. Some defensive breakdowns are starting to show up now. Their last four buckets allowed have come from very close range. And giving up these easy chances is going to do wonders for their confidence. He's created some good opportunities for himself and made the most of them. Now here's Porter. He's tightly guarded. Solid defense there from Gibson. New York leading by 21. Here's Knox. Oh, oh nice. how about that basketball, oh, man? Wow. Here he comes, and there he goes. Look at him punish that rack. You know, the guys on the bench are going crazy right now at the sight of that jam. The Knicks making a switch here. Now Porter. 12 points for him. Now we have a moment to see the best rebounding teams in the league. Second to next. Yeah, this team's success has always been tied to their rebounding. Just a physically dominant club.
And he makes both free throws. New York's gone into the three-point range four times since halftime and buried two of them. Here's Frank. The Knicks rebound. Noel. Tries yet again. No good from Gibson. Stolen away. Banked in off the glass. There's a minute 40 left to play here in the third. Wilson into the lane. Three-pointer Augustine. No luck. And New York the other way now. But an eight-rebound advantage like the one they have now is always going to swing the score hard in that team's direction. And that's certainly been the case today. Their rebounding has made a huge difference. He's far too tentative in the paint. And even more so when the defender is up tight on him like that time. Now the pass to Wilson. Feeds it to Porter. Brings the three-pointer. Porter's got nine points here in the second half. Yeah, and that's his first three of the half. There may be more in store. Passes to Frank. Out of bounds. Knicks ball as New York keeps possession of it. Here's what the schedule says for the New York Knicks and what it looks like. Looking ahead to their next game, playing at New Orleans, they'll match up against the Pelicans. That'll be the second on the road in the midst of this long four-game road stand. Noel passes to Knox. Takes a three. He's been anything but his usual self this quarter. It's actually been ugly to see. Rockets trail by 21. Augustine passes to Wilson. And Augustine kicks the quarter. And good. Coming in on the assist by DJ Augustine. Augustine's got four assists in the game. Well, the grimace of pain tells it all. He's hurt, and let's hope he's okay. Mm, injuries are such a difficult part of this game. And from a glance, you really can't tell just how bad it is, but he's going to come out, and we'll find out now how bad it is. He may be done for the game. Or the three gets it to go. 18 points for him. This is great stuff, guys. You can tell he's hurting, but he continues to play well. The Rockets shooting a mediocre 41% in this one. The layup off target. Pass to Frank. The good looking shot from the wing. Five seconds left to play in the third. Number two. No good on that last second attempt there. The three quarters of play all in the world. This one all but over The NBA season pushes on. And we welcome you back as we get going here in the fourth quarter. The final quarter of play can change everything. New York leading by 23. And New York looking at who they've got. They've got Robinson. And it's Frank in at the shooting guard. And the pass to Randall. Here's Knox. A three-pointer off the mark. And here's Wilson. Tate, the pass to Wilson. Makes the lead pass. And a foul called on the shot. Got him on the way up that time, so he'll shoot two right here. Number two. The first one falls. The Rockets making a switch here. Porter's checked in. He hits both from the strike. Down low. Here's Knox. And he caught that pass in full stride on his way to the big slam. Now that was pretty. That was just a nice looking reverse jam right there. Use the rim, Clark, to protect the ball, I think, too, a little bit. Yeah, yeah. did a nice job with it. Yeah, no question. Kept great awareness and terrific finish to the paint and so he draws the foul on the shot on trip to the line to shoot two and this is what the schedule looks like for Houston and that's game two of this string of four games played at home two shots first one calls for him. Alec Burks checked in for the Knicks both free throws good from Tate the Knicks leading by 21 Pass to Knox. 
Oh, and it looks like that's going to be a goaltending goal. Yep, that's it. So they'll get the basket. Kelly, he almost got to that shot in time, but not quite. You can't touch the ball once it's on the way down. Now you can tell what the crowd thinks about that call. Yeah, they erupted as soon as the whistle blew. The Rockets making a switch here. Oh, Lennox checked in. Another good look there, and that's his second three-pointer of the game. Pass to Knox. And he was fouled on the way up. Two free throws now for him. At the line of the next, Knox. He misses the free throw. And he's good on the second. Rockets trail by 21. Final quarter of play, about a minute and a half off the clock into it. Here's Olenek. Gets to the rim for two with the D all over him. Knicks have gone two of three from the field to get the fourth quarter start. The feed to Burks. And that one's drained from the low block. And the Knicks lead by 21. And their field goal percentage continues to climb. They've really shot the ball well here today so far. Yeah, and it's all about quality shot selection, smart shot selection. They've been very patient on offense. Good job using his speed advantage to create the separation he needed for the shot. The Knicks making a switch here. The Knicks leading by 18. The pass to Knox. Number five. No good on the triple. The Rockets have gotten all three of their shots to drop here in the fourth quarter. They came out of the break on a roll. Gordon dishes to Olenek. Kicks it out to Wilson. He passes to Porter. It's rebounded by Knox. Boy, I tell you what, guys. He's an extremely strong finisher. I'm surprised he wasn't able to power that through the defense. Number one. Offensive rebound. Noel. Rejected by Olenek. But they get it back. Here's Noel. And counts the basket. He was fouled. And he's going to the line for one more. Their prowess inside has been tremendous, guys. I mean, it's been no contest down on the low block. And until they prove they can stop them, I mean, they ought to continue to pound it in low. And the Rockets making a change here. Houses checked in. And that one's good. Augustine's got five points in the quarter. Well, he's been a real positive factor for them today, although, you know, as a team, they've had a lot of negatives mixed in there as well. Number one. New York, no good that time either. Well, I tell you what, that's too good a look to pass up there. Even though it didn't go, that's one you got to take. Number five, defended by Olenek. New York moving the ball around. It's rebounded by Olenek. You know, nine times out of ten, he's going to knock that one down. He'll spray that one on you. Augustine passes to Wilson. It's Porter outside, and that one's good. Porter's got 15 points here in the second half. He's showing no signs of letting up here. Time call here. The Knicks decide to talk it over. Passes to Knox. Offline with his three. Rockets trail by 16. Porter kicks to Hunts. The finger roll finish at the bucket. New York's gone ice cold from three-point land 0-4 since the start of the final quarter. Pass to Knox. Six to shoot from downtown. That is good. 
26 points for him. I think they're trying to go for the kill here. I mean, they're starting to take a lot more three-point shots than they had been before looking to run away. Yeah, and that's fine as long as you're making them, but uh, make sure you don't start launching bad shots. That's a problem. There's a good screen. Augustine dishes to Porter. Kicks it out to Wilson. Pass to Augustine. Here's Olenek. Another shot. It's rebounded by New York. Noel's got nine rebounds now tonight. A pass to Knox. Nice D from House. Nuggets trail by 17. Here's Augustine. Soft touch off the glass. Augustine's got seven now in this quarter. You know, of the last six baskets, five have come on the interior. This is major smash mouth basketball, guys. Love it. Old school. Just physical play in the paint. Dominate. Rejected by House. Here is Porter. No good with the layup. And it's DJ Augustine with the foul. Now it's his third foul of the game. And New York making a change here. Burks is checked in. A minute 50 left in the game. Dishes it to Noel. Five to shoot. Here's Randall. Good. And the Knicks lead by 17. Ooh, they are not letting up, guys. They just keep coming at them. And I'd say that lead is too big to overcome at this point. Okay, fans, for your entertainment, we have our very corner, Augustine. Augustine. Good. Augustine's got 14 points now in the second half. Right now, the defense needs to do a better job of closing out on this guy. He's heating up from outside. Kicks it to Burks. He passes to Randall. He's against Wilson. 11 feet away. No good from Randall. Houston's gone three or four from downtown here in the fourth. Here's House. And good. Coming in on the assist by DJ Augustine. Beautiful work in the transition game. That's how to do it. Attack early before the defense can get itself set. Burks can't get it to go. Rockets trail by 12. House the pass to Augustine. There's the dish to Porter. He kicks it to Augustine. Shot clock at six. He feeds it to Olenek. And here's a nice one-handed slam. Great game for him. Double double that. 11 points and 10 rebounds. 51 seconds left in the fourth quarter. And it's D.J. Augustine with the foul. That will get him his fourth foul of the game. And that fourth foul might force him to scale back the aggression defensively a little bit. He does not want to pick up number five. So New York ends up going with the new group. Now here's Gibson. First free throw is good. That one misses, so he goes one for two. A slight hiccup at the line, but he did what he needed to to finish this game off. Brown, good. Brown. Seven second difference, shot and game clock. New York's gone into a funk from downtown in the fourth. Only one of their five three-pointers has found the bottom of the bucket. First free throw is good, and that will push the lead to double digits. And both free throws good from Gibson. And it just feels like those are the free throws that probably put this game out of reach. Number two. Hit the wide by Houston. And the shot counts. He's fouled, and it's a chance for a three-point play. You know, there's no fear out of him, guys. I mean, he's going straight to the hoop against a much bigger defender. Uh, he's got a lot of heart. Burks, the pass to Frank. Defensive foul. 
Good on the first, and that'll push the lead to double digits. Both shots good from the strike. Here's Bradley. So no problem for New York as they get the win.